What's up, Pre-PT Nation? This is a shock and awe video today. Um, as I've been, we've been going through and doing all of these cheapest DPT program lists, we've definitely come across some programs that their tuition numbers definitely make your, your eyes kind of leap out of your head um, and make your jaw drop. So number one thus far for the most expensive that we've seen that's just, you know, kind of broken my heart is University of Southern California, okay? So we're gonna go through some numbers. We're gonna give you a breakdown of how much money this program makes on the backs of their students, okay? So if we come down here, first we're gonna look at class statistics, okay? So participating size of the next entering class, 150 students. Uh, recent class was 151, all right? So we'll just say 150 students to make it a, a more even number. We're gonna come up here. Tuition is just over $200,000 and uh, fees are just under 15,000, okay? So if we put this all together, we're gonna look at this. 150 students, okay? $216,000 for tuition and fees. You multiply this number by 150, 32 and a half million dollars, just about, is what they make off of one cohort, okay? One cohort of students. That's crazy town, okay? But then we have to remember that there's also multiple other cohorts that are running in that program the same time since most programs are three years. So you have three cohorts in this program and that's almost $100 million off of the three cohorts that are in that program. That number is insanity to me, okay? Considering that there is no data that we have that shows that someone who graduates from USC makes gobs of money more than someone who graduates from any other DPT program, okay? If they have the data, if they have the receipts to show that they are making way more money, then by all means, show me that. This isn't like a Harvard or a Stanford MBA where if you graduate with a master's in business administration from those programs, you are making an extra 60 to $70,000 more starting salary than someone who graduates from, let's say, Arizona State University's MBA program, okay? So, um, and that's not a bag on Arizona State, Arizona State's program, but it's just to give you an example, like your average MBA program compared to um, these other top tier programs that you pay out the nose for, there's at least some, um, some data that shows that there is a reason why if you pay more, you're gonna make more over the, the lifetime of your career, okay? That those numbers do not exist as far as I've looked, all the research I've done, those numbers do not exist for DPT programs. If you graduate from USC versus you graduate from um, Angelo State University in Texas, which is a really cheap, affordable program, your salary is going to be the same. The only thing that makes a difference is the state that you're practicing in and the setting that you're working in. Um, those are the things that make the difference. So, in my opinion, sunshine is the best medicine for these type of issues. Uh, I know USC is a private institution and they can charge whatever they want, but if you are considering applying to this program, please think twice um, because regardless, you're going to graduate. This is just this is just tuition. This isn't cost of living. This isn't factoring in your undergraduate loans, other things like that. There's an article on Student Loan Planner that came out in June that asked if going to USC's DPT program is financially viable, if it's worth it. And it's it's a hundred percent a worthy question to ask, right? Um, and you know they might have wonderful people who work here, but this debt is a reality when you come out of school. No matter what, that debt is going to be a reality. So that's why I'm sharing this video. If you're someone who goes to USC and you're going to completely bash me for this, go ahead. In my opinion, this is criminal. This is this is slavery. You're putting kids in financial slavery regardless of whether they're gonna do a forgiveness program or they're gonna do the um, income-based repayment and then just do the tax bomb at the end, that's a huge tax bomb. That's hundreds of thousands of dollars in a tax bomb. So uh, thanks for watching this video. I hope this has opened your eyes. Please find the cheapest DPT programs that you can. We need to try to drive cost of tuition down by applying to the uh, programs that are least expensive and avoiding these programs that are extremely expensive.